right now. It was already a disgusting case of abuse and neglect, and now investigators say it was murder. And police say the mother in the Blackstone house of squalor killed her children. Erica Murray already faced charges of fetal death concealment. Four children were also removed from the house. Her boyfriend, Raymond Rivera, was charged for the first time today. He shook in court during his arraignment. Jim Armstrong joining us live in our satellite center with more. Jim. Jonathan, Rivera's lawyer says that in court today was actually the first time he had heard that all of the children found in his home, live and dead, were biologically his. That includes the two youngest babies, as well as the four dead infants that were hidden in his closets. And tonight, prosecutors and a grand jury say there's just no way he could have been in the dark this whole time. Not Raymond Rivera barely able to speak as he hears the terrible, gruesome facts of the case against him. Uh, he's despondent at this point. Shaking so badly, the judge asked him if he needed to sit down, but the 38-year-old remained standing as prosecutors described what they found in his Blackstone house this summer. Along with three decomposing bodies of his babies, there were two other children, baby girls, six months old and three years old, who had never seen the light of day, confined here their whole lives. The pediatrician said that the only thing she could compare these extreme instances of neglect to were video footage she had seen of Romanian orphanages. Those five children and two older ones, a boy and a girl, ages 10 and 13, fathered by Rivera and his girlfriend, Erica Murray. She's now been indicted for murder by the same grand jury that Tuesday brought these new charges against Rivera. I've never seen anything like the facts in this case. Rivera had claimed he lived in the basement here, but prosecutors say he and Murray slept just seven or eight feet from the two children he claimed to know nothing about. The noise level caused by the six months old crying in the home was blistering, and that the three-year-old would repeatedly bang on the walls in the door of the bedroom that she was confined in. Tonight, Rivera is being held on $100,000 cash bail. Erica Murray also behind bars. As for their children, the two older kids are with Rivera's mother, their grandmother. As for the two younger ones, the DA says those are the ones who have the most significant needs. But in his words tonight, they're being cared for, they're clean, and they're being fed. Live in the Satellite Center, Jim Armstrong, WBZ News.